In this video, I will show you where to find the description area of a web page and how to put in new information. By default, if you don't put proper information into your description, Google will just find anything on your page and use it as a description. Okay, I've already logged into the website, so I'm into my dashboard area. I'll scroll down to pages. I'll go to all pages. Here you'll see a list of all your pages here. And uh, I can, now that I'm logged in to my pages, I can see I've got 64 items, so 64 pages here. To scroll through them, I can scroll down. And if I want to see more, I can just hit this button over here and it'll show me another group of pages and you can do that till the end. Okay, I'm going to go back to, to the first one here. Okay, so this is my template, don't bother about it. So the first page here is the abandoned farmhouse. You would go to edit. You will you're not using Elementor here. You're scrolling down to this area down here. Now, in this example, it's clear to see that you have already put in a snippet here and it's the perfect length. So I would say it's a good idea to grab your first snippet using a notepad. So I know this is the perfect length. So, so when I am creating a new snippet, I know that it's going to take, this is the length. You're just going to use this as a template. It doesn't mean you're putting in the same information. Okay, so I always keep one as a template. So that's it. You put the information in here. And then you would go back up here and hit the update button. Very important. Everything you do needs to be updated. And that's it.